Hello there, this is Peter Beckenham from Thai Village Marketing. It's a sad fact of life, but 95% of all new businesses fail. And that includes those who start online, and especially in the network marketing industry. 95%. Unbelievable. It's got nothing to do with the enthusiasm of the new recruit or the interest of the new recruit, or the hopes and desires and dreams of the new recruit. It's got nothing to do with that. I mean, a good business opportunity with the wrong person is like putting a nail in a tyre. It'll deflate. The tyre will go down, and so will the person, the wrong person in the right business opportunity. They'll deflate, and if you continue with it, they could destroy themselves. They'll fail, and unfortunately, become part of the 95%. So many people put everything into the business opportunity they get, but they fail and they walk away empty-handed, demoralized, and broke. Now, why is that? Maybe it's a lack of skills. Maybe it's a loss of focus. Maybe they're overwhelmed or swamped with information. Maybe it's missed opportunities, or more importantly, opportunities not taken when offered. Maybe it's a lack of structure or a lack of systems. Perhaps a loss of momentum or a lack of confidence or perhaps a lack of belief, a true belief. Maybe it's slow or even no cash flow. That will definitely kill off a new business opportunity. Or maybe it's a lack of a real commitment. Any of those things could be the death knell for a small business. Now you could probably handle one or two of those, okay, and still be successful. But if more than that was there, then the outcome is pretty predictable. Failure. Sad but true, that's what happens. The problem is time. Time is the key. It takes time to get to a point when you can run your business, when you can when you know what's going on, when you know how to be successful. It takes time to be able to handle things like the social media aspects of your business, building your online reputation, creating compelling ad copy, um, creating an opt-in for your list, creating traffic funnels, generating traffic, lead generation, creating the right persona, graphic design maybe, for your blog or your website, free and or paid advertising, blogging, the skills of blogging, SEO, search engine optimization, sales calls, follow up, video marketing. I mean, the list goes on. There are so many things that a new person to the industry has to be able to grapple, get their hands around. To get experience in this takes time. And unfortunately, people don't have that time. They run out of money before they get the experience that's required. I mean, they try hard. They really try hard. But they burn out. And they usually burn out because of lack of cash flow. And they leave disappointed, frustrated, and usually broke. So they leave that business opportunity. But these people usually still want to succeed. They have this desire to succeed. So after a cooling off period, they'll try another opportunity. But sadly, they take into that new opportunity the same issues they, that caused them to fail in the previous opportunity. And the same outcome is predictable. Failure. This is the market we're catering to in network marketing. And for sure, you and me will be probably talking with people right now who have been failures in a previous business opportunity, even a previous networking, network marketing opportunity. And they'll have these issues and hidden frustrations and fears inside them. And it doesn't matter who you are, they will fail. I will guarantee you, they will fail unless you can teach them and get them to implement a model, a business system that can be easily duplicated. Provide them with a system that takes away the need for all that training before they get started. Just get, give them the basics, enough 
to be able to get their blogs is set up and running. And if you have a blog system that is easy to use, that's even better. The key issue is to be able to get some cash into their hands as quickly as possible. Build on that initial interest and enthusiasm. Show them that they can be a winner, even at a little level. If you can do that, then instead of having a person who started off inspired, but then doesn't get any cash flow, spends more and more and more time on training to try and get the skills they think is necessary, become even more frustrated, lose confidence, lose self-belief, and end up completely full of fear, frustration, and a total failure. Instead of that, with a system that they can duplicate and keep things simple and show them how to get started quickly. These people can start with their inspiration, then get some initial success and get some cash flow. And that cash flow will build their self-confidence and their self-belief. And as that grows, they can then reinvest in their business. And if they reinvest in their business, okay, they start to generate wealth. And if they start to generate wealth, then they're starting to achieve freedom. And that is a completely different scenario to the first one. All because you can provide them with a system that can be duplicatable. But a word of warning. As a leader, team leader or a sponsor, even if you do give your new recruits access to a system they can duplicate, to training that they can use and implement as they go along, irrespective of the, the quality of the blog platform they use, people will still fail. And they will fail because they're not willing to do what is necessary to do in order to succeed. And that is to take massive action every single day. Sadly, people want what they can't have, irrespective of whether they really want it or not. That's the real world. No doubt done for you systems and that include things like sales funnels, etc plus superior training, plus great leadership, will, will greatly increase the chances of success for a new recruit. There's no doubt about that. But to improve your chances of, of success as a team leader, as a sponsor, my advice is to test the willingness of that new recruit as soon as you can. Test their willingness, not their interest, not their enthusiasm, not their capacity to learn, okay? Test their willingness. And it's their willingness to implement, their willingness to take action. Give them some small tests to see whether they are the type of person you want, whether they are the right person in the right business opportunity, not the nail in the tyre. If you do this, it'll save both you and the new prospect a lot of time and a lot of frustration. This business of network marketing is not for everybody. It's not. It doesn't matter whether you're young or old. It's not for everybody. It's only for those who have the genuine willingness to apply themselves and to actually take action every single day and to implement things and to, and to start things without really knowing whether they can do it. Don't wait to be a fully trained specialist before you start doing anything. You've got to take action. You know and I know. Only those who are totally dedicated and committed to taking action every single day will succeed. So we must never, ever downplay the, the road that is required to, to be followed in order to be successful in network marketing. It's not an easy road. It can be a fantastic road to freedom for the right person. But for the wrong person, one of fear, failure and frustration. I hope you found that helpful. See you next time. Bye for now.